Hi, this is Slime Dog. And Topo. And today we're playing Song of the Deep. Uh, this is the new release from uh, Game Trust slash GameStop, and uh, it's it's for the PS4, uh, and it's it's quite fun. We've been having we played it a little bit so far, got a little bit into it, but it's on other systems. We have the PS4 version that we're playing. Yes, it's also available on PC and Xbox One. Yes. Okay, continue. GameStop's new venture into publishing. This is their first. They're really going, having a blast putting out their. All sorts of info. I've been getting tweets from Marin. This is a little girl whose father is a fisherman. It's just the two of them, and he goes off one day and doesn't come home. So she builds herself a little sub of junk parts and goes out looking for him. It's so far, we've just started it. It's really a nice uh, exploring game, and some fish will attack uh, underwater stuff. They're not all fish. And, uh, other creatures will follow you, though we haven't had a whole lot of following yet. We've built up a couple parts of it. When you first start out, you just, like, swim around. Um, or whatever, sub around. Um, and you don't get a claw until a little bit in, and then you get a turbo boost a little bit later, and a little bit stronger holes, hull, so that your health stays a little bit longer. Uh, we haven't had any issues with the health, or or beating enemies yet, so... It doesn't seem particularly or, or especially uh, difficult at this phase, but we're, we're also just getting started on it. Now one of the things, like, <clears throat> go up there where you just were with those barnacles, there's... it looks like that's a thin area, maybe we need an explosive to get through, or she can get out and swim, but we haven't gotten that ability yet. I we're, presume at some point we'll get, uh, um, what's that called? A, a, wetsuit or something to be able to go out from the sub. At the moment we're restricted to the sub. We have a claw that a little bit longer than the first one you get and um, per, uh, turbo boost and a little bit extra health. We're going now through a... We're going to Skeleton Reef through, was it Watcher's Pass I think it was called? Watcher's something. Watcher's um, it's it's a super scary area. Yes, I mean, hello, spider webs. On how to turn our headlights off, so I'm guessing light is going to play an, a, a part here. Um, to kind of sum it up, it's it's a, a Metroidvania game. If you're familiar with it, you start off with very little in terms of uh, upgrades and abilities and mobility. Over to the right. And oh, sorry, you see something? Yeah, there's gold coins. Over. Ooh, we need to see oh. that. Yeah, no, oh, oh, come on, we can almost get it. Here, maybe if I push. You know, I've got a turbo boost that you can push against the tide, but. Looks like I'm not getting through there. Let's Be careful, too, because I think you turn your lights <clears> on. <throat> oh, it looks like it's a thin pass through there. Look at your yeah. map again. It looks like a thin... I'm going to move out of the way so my icon's not blocking it. Yes, I think Yeah, you're right. so you'll have to swim up to that, probably. At any rate, Metroid... Um, it, uh, uh, Metroid being a 2D game. Um, uh, it's really an excellent one, too, honestly. It's, we don't get a whole, whole lot of these in the world of AAA titles and stuff. This is the sort of game that would usually be released on... on uh, Xbox Live or PSN is like maybe a twenty dollars title, and that's why the uh, the retail disc itself is also twenty dollars. So, um, it don't expect like a full blown Grand Theft Auto AAA, but it is at that same time it has an amazing level of quality to it. Yes. The, the background, the art, everything is really well done. The music is beautiful, uh, and the game itself, the level design, um, is, as far as we can tell so far, is very well crafted. So, uh, a lot of bang for your bucks, a lot of quality overall. You think those things are going to hurt me? Uh, oh, no, I'm totally... Okay, they can't what's the almost. green thing? Um, they look like the snakes from up top, ooh, but... I wonder if I turn the light off. Yes. There you go. Away. Now you don't get... Bugged. Actually, the green things didn't hit me before. They no, but, but they'll keep you out of... Oh. oh. Aha! That's there cool. you go. So We've noticed sometimes you can <clears> activate <throat> little treasure drops. Yes, there's a lot of discovering, and like any good Metroidvania, I'll, most of the game seems to be focused on exploration. There's enemies, and you've got right now we've got a claw that we can hit things with, and that's about it. We don't have any torpedoes or guns, but they might be coming up in future upgrades, I would assume. Um, but the focus of the game definitely seems to be more on exploration. Um, so if you're looking for something that's like missile pack thrill a minute, uh, you might be barking up the wrong tree here. Do you think I can make those go down? Yeah, and they're going to hurt you. Oh, yeah, that'll tear me up. But you see there's a... There's a treasure in there. There's a treasure yeah. in there, too. In fact, treasures seem to be a part of it. Uh, there's 209 scattered throughout the game. It marks them all on your map as you uncover them, so you can come back when you have the right gear and pick them up as you go. 
I don't think that's good. That's not good. Use your claw. Use your claw. Use my claw? Okay, I heard some. Got well, it. you know it hurts him. Well, I don't know it hurts him. Uh, this is, you know, you can hit, you know, but you can hit your, uh, what are those? Guy? I don't know. But he's not red either. If it's, if it's red, it's, <clears throat> it's, it'll damage you. If it's green, you can pick it up. Oh, they respawn. No. Ah. Uh. Go up. There's, oh, that's like can yellow stuff that we don't get. Yeah. Can you get, oh, again with the swimming. So that's a narrow pass, yeah. presumably. I yeah, hope we soon. get our uh, wetsuit or whatever that is soon. This glass thing is breaking. Is, what uh, is this? I don't know. He's the guy you said it wasn't going to hurt you. Well, shine the light on him. I want to see what he does. I think we have to follow him. Okay. <clears> Let's <throat> do that. There's, oh. Uh, Timmy's trapped in the well. we got to follow him. <laughs> Oh, Lassie oh, fish. Okay, watch this. Oh, there we go. Oh, cuddle pups. That's why. Now, for what it's worth, I swear to God that the narrator is the same narrator from Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles in the GameCube. Maybe I just think all... Irish voices sound alike, but I think it's the same person. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Um, show those over there on the left. <clears throat> there's the down. There's this thing. Um, they're rock formations that are breakable, presumably. Oh, We've yet to be able to... We don't have what <clears throat> we need. Um, s there are explosive items that you can pick up and throw to, to blow up. Bombs you gotta follow that cuddle, cuddle pup up there. Okay. Follow him. Um, but we, you know, there's a limited range on them, so yeah, they, if they there's not a bomb nearby, seconds, then so you're, you can't. You can't lug them all the way across right. the map. Hey, what's down here? You think that's good? Yeah, th is that, it's a treasure, okay, can go this way first. Well, we got the cuddle pup. Is that really the name for it? Are we it yes, she, she just said. You were talking about her voice, but there's cuddle pups is what it said. Why would it uh, it tug it? Uh, maybe. Oh, uh, I see. It's. <coughs> Jeez, it's definitely Yes. Um. When the, when it comes back around, you can go out. I have to pull it out. Okay. Wait till the uh, yeah, catch up with the cuddle pup. Oh, there you go. Okay. Operation. Go up pup. to the. Go, go up to up, the. Go up. Go up to the treasure chest over on the right. Up here, on the right. Yeah. Watch out for that bat that's hanging above your head. I don't know if it's a bat, but... Oh, it's probably nothing. We oh, can't... Oh, it's got a lock on it. Look, it's got a lock on it's it. It's locked. It's an <gasps> item, so... Ah. Here, I'll fling starfish at it. You can yeah. use your... Oh, no. oh, oh, do that. Make that thing drop <clears> down <throat> on it. Make the bat, whatever that thing is. Oh, probably... No, oh. pull it and pull it down on it. Oh, see, you can't, see. I'm grabbing it. I'm oh, you can't it. grab it. Okay. Claw. Oh, same as that. <gasps> oh, Try I'm the so urchin. Frustrated. Try the sea urchin. I don't know. Ooh, That's snazzy. Yeah. Can you get to it? Uh, of course I can. Sometimes there's um, invisible walls. Sort of. Um, it looks like it's blocked, but you can swim through them. This one, it looks like we access from the other side, according to the map. Probably. Yeah. Reading that right. Yeah. Oh, okay, on oh you but know what? You probably need that electrical claw. Would probably zap that thing down. Oh, maybe that's it? Yeah, maybe there's something else. We've been to the shop. They're hermit crabs, and they have little shops around that you can uh, <clears throat> you can buy upgrades to your weapons, your health, and your hull. Um, what else? Your claw. Oh, the, oh. the propulsion. It's also worth mentioning, picking up and throwing things is much easier than I thought. When I first started onto it. I thought you had to kind of swing it on there and then sort of let go and let gravity help you to get stuff around. No, no, no. It's actually much easier than that. You just point in the direction with your move stick and hit square and poof, it launches the sea urchin or whatever in that direction. Can you go from underneath here to grab that uh, hook from below? up The one you were trying to get at before? Yeah. yeah. The pedal up on those. Oh, no, I can't no, can you re see what I'm saying? Because it highlights it. I feel know. really dumb calling these cuddle pups. I'm to. sorry, but that's what it said on the thing. <laughs> Not cuddle, like cuddling. 
Can you get it from the oh, side here? Oh, cuddle like squid. S yes. It doesn't matter. It still sounds like cuddles. Uh huh. I have to go back in there if you want me to wrap again. At least you don't have the stuff coming at you so much. Uh, wait till your grab hold and wait till your cuddle pup comes by so you can go swing around there. <laughs> Stop. It's like super troopers. I'm going to pistol whip the next person who says cuddle pup. <laughs> oh no, you let go. <laughs> well, yeah, i got to get out of here. you got to follow the cuddle pup. Well, <laughs> pistol whip <myself. laughs> There, there's the gate. I see. Now it's open. All right. I don't know As why I, I suspected. To out, I told you that's what that was for, but. See, I'm glad you're looking at this. I'm just looking at stuff to shoot. So. No, you're. Oh, and you're also trying to talk about the game, which. Oh, here's one of the hermit hey, okay, cool. the The aforementioned. <laughs> we don't have enough money. 500 to uh, 150. 150 close. <coughs> How much for the. Is it the magnet? Yeah, the, the magnet. And that's the cheapest. Everything uh, else is more expensive from there. So uh, we're gonna need next up is the. That. What's the next? One? That one's five. But what's the the turbine? I want to see what the other one says. Get down here. Oh, this. It's just faster. Uh, uh, high speed turbine. Duration. Okay. Uh, oh, for the duration. duration of the turbo. Okay. Uh, okay. Reduce, we don't know what the fourth one is yet. Oh, that's probably your suit. We gotta find her suit. Which we're assuming exists. It, it may not be. Well, it did because we when did we looked at the. Oh, yeah, a control right. panel, it says get out of sub is I, one of your options. I totally forgot we cheated. Yeah. What do you mean cheated? It's we just checked, we checked the not the control. Not the, kind of no, it was the just control. the layout on your controller. It's mm. not exactly cheating. No, do you have enough? No, oh, you don't. Cheating you don't faces. Stop. Oh, these are the save points and mm -hmm. they heal you. Yes. Oh, oh go down. Let's see if we can get that. Of course we can. Now, like, the vast majority of the treasures, it looks this like one our can. second time through. Oh, but this one we got. No, we've, right. gotten, we've gotten a decent amount. We've got enough to buy our own. What was it? I don't know. Uh, turbo, I think. Exactly. Oh, no, no, we can't get out. No. How did that happen? <laughs> <laughs> you didn't say cuddle pup enough is all I'm saying. I'm <laughs> <laughs> on the cuddle cup pay. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> You're so silly. Bye, honey. Uh, 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 uh. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, my God. Ooh, we've made it through that area. Oh, yay, we've got a warp point. Okay, we can show the warp point, too. Ooh. Oh. Leviathans. Ah. Uh. Let's just turbine back real quick. Not them all, them all. Yeah. See, again, you're not small enough. Yeah, we can. You want to hear? See, now we have two things marked. Yay, let's go <coughs> to the Marrow Ruins. I assume, uh, did you want to go back? Or it says we have to go forward there. Oh. Uh, by the way, another great I just thing, thought we could try it. We can always go back. Can't traditionally, we? make it very difficult. Uh, it's easy to get lost. Like, where do you go next? Where am I supposed to go? I get turned around. This game goes through great pains to stick a giant yellow X on your map to kind of guide you through the game. Now, if you want to deviate and explore, that's great. In fact, most people will. But you should never in this game be thinking, I don't know where to go next. Like, they really, really make sure that you know where you're heading. So, I'm sorry. What's up? I wanted to just try it. You're going to warp back. Okay. I think you can warp there and then warp back. Spinning around. She braced herself against the sides of the sob. When it finally stopped spinning, she had emerged in a different part of the world. And there you have, um... Previously engaged part of the world. <clears throat> okay, these hooks you can grab onto. Usually, um, you'll grab onto them to get through pushing currents because yeah. there are currents that will push you through yeah. uh, push against you push you forward um, you know it's kind of spooky I don't know nothing's uh, going turn on your light maybe turn that'll light. help okay. yeah it's not going to attract anything it is actually going to freak you out here <laughs> oh, wow 
It's a game about a little girl on a scu- sub, and I'm actually unnerved by what I'm going to find in here. Oh, look, big fish. And rocks and stuff. <gasps> There's more okay. of that piping stuff. We found some of this in, a, in uh, the marrow level, I think it was. Ooh, ooh. Yay! We found the diving stuff. This is totally the direction from where the X was telling us, by the way. So. The opposite direction, you say? Yeah. Ah, we need something to blow up these rocky things. It's getting our perfect now. Yeah, I'm guessing that's going to be torpedoes or something. The oh, balls. can you... Fish in the background, freaking me out. They're fine. It's the Leviathan you need to watch out for. The Leviathan. Oh, uh, oh, you can go through. Red Reapers. Red Reapers. They're a myth. That that da. Yeah. Red Reapers. And there you go. Well, I'd say that's a fine time to stop. You got kind of reaped. Okay, let's go. Well, if you're just looking for a taste of it, there you go. That's uh, Song of the Deep. It's an excellent little uh, little game here that put up by Game Press. We're looking forward to the next releases and looking forward to uh, everything Insomniac does. So there you have it. Thanks for joining us.